who thinks that they know what a drop feather might qualify as? Nothing. Yep, absolutely nothing. All right. Do you guys have any questions so far? So, pancakes and waffles are quick bread. Yes, they are. So, are crepes a quick bread? They have. Oh, that's true. They don't have leavening agent. Right. Yes. Okay. Yep. So they have to have leavening yeah. agent. So what about the categorizing? What a crepe? Yeah. It's gonna it land of its own pile. Yeah. It's French. <laughs> it's French. <laughs> so like I said before, in order for it to be a quick bread, it has to have a chemical leavening agent in it. So there are three different types of mixing methods when it comes to making quick breads. The biscuit method, the blending method, and the creaming method. Anyone want to take a guess at what the biscuit method incorporates? Yes, Pat, like what do you think? Dough that you roll out and then like cookie cutter it out. Alright, what do you think the steps would be to making it? So you have your mise en place, you have your dry ingredients, you have dry, your fat. Your fat. So then you're gonna add all your dry ingredients and then you're gonna put in like butter. Yeah. And you're going to incorporate the butter evenly. Awesome. The what is the butter supposed to look like? How do you know when the butter is fully incorporated? Uh, well, you're not going to really like see it. It's kind of... <laughs> what? It's going to be flaky. It's going to be flaky, yes. <laughs> it can resemble cornmeal. All right. And then after, so you're going to have that in your bowl. Yeah. After you have your butter all blended, then what do you do? Uh, add your liquid? Yep, so you dig a little well in the middle, add your liquid, and slowly incorporate oh, from the inside out. Alright, blending method. Anyone have any ideas about a blending method? I don't think you guys. Cyril? Uh, blending method has to utilize a liquid oil. Yep. And most commonly combined with the sugar, and so it starts to dissolve the sugar present before you add the product. Absolutely. So you have your sifted dry ingredients, and then you separately combine your eggs and your sugar, and then incorporate them together. So that's the blending method. What? Sorry. Go ahead. What would be classified as a blending? Like, what uses a blending method? What do you guys think? If a biscuit method is obviously for biscuits, creaming method is for muffins. What do you think blending method could also be for? <laughs> muffins, absolutely. So you can use blending and creaming for muffins. And for the final creaming method, what do you think creaming method entails? You should know this from your freshman class, yes. I'm going to take a shot. It's absolutely. You, you take butter and sugar and you blend it together and then you add your dark ingredients to that mixture. Close, yep. Yeah. Okay, so you have your fat and your sugar together. Mix it until it's nice and light and fluffy. Then you're going to add in your eggs one at a time until each one is fully incorporated. And then with your liquid and your flour, you alternate them, usually into three, por three portions. Yeah. So you alternate. So, yeah. <laughs> Why do you break it down into these different portions? Why does it, it helps, that different between like, just doing it all? Helps prevent lumping. And clumping together with the flour. So, next I have what we're going to be doing is an advertisement. I have provided us with those four, or we'll do three different recipes. Each of the recipes, what I want you to do is you're going to create an advertisement on this poster board. Up here I have markers, um, colored pencils, and permanent markers. And using, I have a packet, this packet and your book on chapter 28, you're going to look at the terminology of what creates a good quick bread. Um, when it comes to advertising, which words you would think that you can find that would be good to put on the poster board, such as it means tender, having an even crumb throughout. And so if you guys want to partner up, you want to do Kyle and Raya. Cyril and Nicole and then Nick and Hazel. All right, so I have, you guys can use the triple berry oat muffin. So I just printed this out, but you're pretty much just gonna come together and create a poster advertisement. So you can draw pictures, have a description with it as well. I want you guys to do 
It's a loaded bacon, cheddar, and basil waffle with tomato jam. And you guys can pick from either cranberry orange scones or a lemon almond bread. Oh, interesting. So, like I said, does everyone have their books tonight? Yes. All right, you can go get your book. Chapter 28. You're welcome. I'm on serious Can I wear it? Absolutely. It's whatever you guys want to do. So pretty much do this, you're going to go over the information that we're going to do. Is your post to board? I'm going to go ahead and do that. markers over there, color pencils. There's some more markers if anyone wants them. Yeah, I'm going to...